Okay, I'm still uh, looking into uh, the kind of outdoor cooking uh, lifestyle that I'm um, that feels right. Uh, I'm not really seeing um, uh, things things aligning exactly how I need them to, uh, especially when it comes to price. I I. I might want to spend a little extra money on something like that, the firebox and a transgia. I'm not sure. It's it's really tough to say. Um, uh, I was I was thinking about um, I'm uh, I'm getting this. Um, I get th three payments from. The uh, the lawsuits when I when I lost all my money and um, prosper. Uh, this is the month. I, I think I'm getting like three hundred dollars or something for losing six thousand or so. Um, I think this is the month. That, but they have to mail it to me, and I don't have an address. And last year it was the first payment of about three hundred. And uh, I had to I had to wrangle with them a lot and uh, get them to like direct deposit it. Uh, I think I'm gonna have to do that again. Um, but it's this should be the month where I get it. Um, I'd like to to use that money and, and maybe put it towards some kind of cooking outdoor cooking deal. So I really need to warm up the the water in the winter time I, I i i tried i tried relying on on the the uh the stores the gas stations but that just doesn't work there's not enough of them especially for a lot of the places that i gone um so i i need to uh figure it out because i i've been looking on on the the internet for for various um, ideas and stuff. There's the paint can, the paint can cooker, the soup can cooker, the cat food can cooker, the pop can cooker. Anything that's metal, I think. That's that's the theme. It's just it's got to be a nice sturdy metal thing that you can you can drill a lot of holes into. Because uh, all you got to do is put a fire in there. I mean, the rocket stove looks nice, but it's it's a little too fancy. People have got to add too much weight to it and stuff. I, I'm I'm not too I'm not too concerned about making a fancy rocket stove. Just a can, I think. I think the pop can is too small, but but for 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 wood, but the right size for gas. Um, I think the wood a wood burner would need to be the size. Uh, of a of a paint can or a coffee can that would be probably more ideal um, and I've been looking at this firebox which is like sixty dollars you could fold it up it's like a foldable paint can you know if you if you wanted to use a paint can that would take up a lot of extra space in the car but if something's foldable but then again metal is supposed to warp over time after being exposed to a lot of uh, fire and high heat and that concerns me too it's like you know I, I would want something that's a little more throwaway as well not just you know splurge on some some uh, you know higher class uh, type of uh, metallic uh, art that, that yeah it's gonna go to waste after uh, a few cookings I need it to last for a long time if I'm gonna buy pay a lot of money for it or I need you know to be able to to have alternatives always always uh, present and I'm, I'm just not sure like w what what the best option is I don't I don't see a lot of paint cans or coffee cans lying around there's plenty of soda cans, and that's that's easy to work with. I can I can uh, turn that into like a, a transgia, but uh, I might want a real transgia too. Um, I'm, I'm just I'm not sure. It's the cost that's really it's really uh, affecting my decisions. But I need to make a decision quick.